my first video in two months. Yay! <laughs> Hello everyone, have you missed me? Because I have missed you. It's been two months since the last video, maybe a little bit more than that. And in this video, I wanted to sort of explain why and what's been happening. And also in the second part, so, so that will be the first part, right? In the second part, I wanted to talk about the future of the channel, what I have in mind and all that kind of stuff. So I've taken some notes because I don't want this video to go everywhere and I don't want to rumble too much. So if you follow me on Twitter, you might have seen a couple of my tweets uh, about what I'm going to talk about now. If you don't follow me on Twitter, what are you waiting for? I know it's a bit of an old person sort of social media, but it's great, it's great there. We, we, we have fun, we have fun. So follow me, uh, all the links are in the description box below. So I went through a breakup. I'm not gonna go through the details of everything. It's not even that interesting. It's just a typical breakup, like things don't work out, that kind of thing. So obviously that takes a bit of a toll on your mental health and you're not really sort of all giggles and sunshines, I guess. <laughs> and then as, and there was a coincidence as well, which is that I started a new job, so I had to move houses. So that's why the background is different. This is not the final sort of background. I'm still going to put up some decorations and it's going to look better. Uh, basically, I don't know if I have secured the job 100% yet <laughs> and I need to secure the job to keep the, the place where I am now, um, if that makes sense. So yeah, I'm a bit stressed at the moment, to be honest. <laughs> but in about 10 days to two weeks, I should find out if I'm gonna keep the place and the job. And that's basically it. And I feel like I also needed a bit of a break from YouTube anyway. So all of these things happened at the same time, but they were kind of necessary for me anyway, because I've been creating content for five years, imagine that. Uh, so having two months off uh, YouTube is kind of nice. And I feel like I'm a bit more refreshed and I've got new ideas and I feel like I want to do it again. Not that I didn't want to do it before, but you know what I mean. I just feel like I've got more energy, more, more. The passion is back. The, the flame is back, <laughs> essentially. I'm a bit hyper. I'm sorry. I'm just very excited about recording a video. So for the second part, because enough of the personal stuff, it's not that interesting. Um, what's going to happen with this channel, essentially? So I have taken a break off uh, Japanese as well during those two months. Not completely. I've been doing my Anki reviews so every day every two or three days rather I need to be transparent here <laughs> I haven't done my reviews every day I haven't done them today yet um, but I'm on top of it so it's not so bad it was a disaster the other day when I had like 150 cards uh, to do and that was quite overwhelming but I went through it and it's fine now we're good, we're good. <laughs> so I want to sort of go back to Japanese, but I will make sure that this channel is not only focused on Japanese because I think, I don't know, I feel like people signed up, uh, subscribed, sorry, to this channel. I don't have the vocab now anymore. <laughs> so I feel like people subscribed to this channel because they wanted language learning content in general, not just Japanese. But I know a lot of you also enjoy my Japanese content. So I'm going to try to balance out, uh, you know, everything. But it's not going to be all about Japanese. But I definitely want to go back to Japanese because I miss it and I'm, I, I lost a lot of my Japanese. And in the long run, um, or like short term, I guess, I would like to uh, do what they called language lessons <laughs> on italki um, because it's been a while and I enjoyed them. Um, but just as soon as I'm more stable in my job, as I explained uh, in the in, at the beginning of the video, uh, I think I will be able to uh, to do that. That's going to be a bit easier. I will have more. Uh, I'll be more relaxed and I will have the mental space necessary for it. On top of wanting to sort of keep my Japanese progress update video series alive, I also would like to try to do more videos in Portuguese and Spanish. Uh, I've tried to do some of them a year or two ago, I think. Uh, no, I did a Spanish one maybe five months ago. And it was nice, it was fun to do. Uh, so I would like to do more of that. But I'm aware that not everyone speaks Portuguese and Spanish, which means that I need to do subtitles, which means that I need to spend an extra hour on each video to write the, subtit the subtitles. So um, it's not easy, it takes a lot of time. <laughs> so I'm gonna try, I'm not promising anything in terms of subtitling everything, but I will try because I know it, I, I want to make my content accessible, obviously. And I know my audience is not necessarily going to speak the languages that I speak um, because you all come from different walks of life in terms of your language learning um, abilities and skills. So I'm going to try to keep this channel English friendly. So either the videos will be in English or there will be subtitles. I'll try. I'm not promising anything, as I said. <laughs> 
On top of all that, I also want to keep on doing reviews. I'm still in the process of reviewing uh, Japanese from Zero. I've done the first two books and I'm trying and I'm planning on doing the, uh, the whole series. In total, for now, there's six books that I'm aware of. There might have been, there might be a seventh out now, but I'm not sure. But I want to do that, but I'm going to spread it out. It's not going to be all in one go because, again, as I said, I want to make sure that not all my content revolves around Japanese because otherwise I'm going to lose some of you. <laughs> I want you guys to stay and I want to keep you but also I don't want to do only Japanese anyway so that that's kind of a good deal for me right I will also be reviewing some apps um, some platforms tools and all that kind of stuff that's related to language learning I will try to make sure it's not like every week but maybe once a month seems like a good balance but we'll see it'll depend on my motivation essentially what I feel like doing because uh, I really try to follow my instinct and my intuition in terms of the videos I make and I always try to enjoy what I do so you know here we go <laughs> and there's another thing that I wanted to talk about yes I want to do more videos about linguistics so I've done a couple of those videos at the very beginning of my channel uh, like four years ago so they very old still hopefully interesting and I still see people coming back to them actually I'm lying I think two years ago I did a video yeah um, against so to speak um, Steve Kaufman because he was misguided about linguistics so I had to correct that obviously that's me right <laughs> um, and yeah so there will be more videos about this I've Plan, I've been planning on doing such videos for such a long time, but I didn't really have the space or energy or motivation to do them. But hopefully, um, again, as soon as I will be a bit more stable um, and I will have, you know, I won't have to worry about my job, for example, then I will be able to sort of focus on that. So, yeah, I, I think these are quite fun projects coming on, right? Um, so yeah, so that's it for this video. It's not going to be a very long one. Obviously, if you have any questions or any comments you want to make, then feel free to do so. I always try to uh, reply to comments. I always read them. Uh, I don't always reply because I'm getting a lot of comments between Twitter and YouTube, but I'm trying and I do read everything. Actually, I really do. So on this note, I will leave you to it and I will see you next week. Hopefully, not in two months. <laughs> All right, see you. Bye.